Hi everyone. Up. How's it going? I'm good, doing good, Carl. Thank good, you. How are you? I get, uh, how are We're you good, doing? doing good. What we've been asked from a few people, and we thought about it as well, um, to tell our little story. Well, mm -hmm. it's actually a really long and big story, so we're gonna try to make it really short. Yeah. And make you guys enjoy it. And um, what's the story of? Oh yeah, a story <laughs> of us, like how we met, and um, that's it. That's it. That's it. Really, that's it. nothing how else. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry if it's noisy outside, but there is uh, people cutting trees and cutting the grass, and unfortunately we can't do anything about that. So no, we can't do so anything we're have about some it. Some soaring in the background. First off, what's up? A little background is we have both been engaged before. Have I? Oh, you have. Yes, I have. <laughs> Unfortunately, and we had. Yeah. With the wrong people. The wrong people. Clearly, didn't work <laughs> out for us. <laughs> so because I didn't work out and it was basically in Scotland I was in Scotland at that time and because I didn't work out I came back to Italy and I thought that would be alone forever and oh. <laughs> yeah. so because of that violin, mini violin <laughs> <laughs> so because of that I decided to get myself a dog to keep me company <laughs> it's name is Pongo. That's why I decided to do it. I just got myself a so dog. I got a dog because he was lonely. Yeah. And what did I do? I moved to Italy. Hold on. Did you did we like break up around the same time? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah, we did. We broke up oh. around the same time. Which is well, quite. But we didn't know each other at that time. But no. Um, it was quite cool though. Yeah. It was. No, no. no. Yours was before Valentine's Day. Because on the Valentine's Day I was here in Italy. Yeah, but mine was after Valentine's Day. Oh, well, around like, that time. Maybe about a few days after, maybe a week after. Mm. Was that like a few weeks before the wedding for you? No, mine was two months before the Oh, wedding. all right. Or three. For me it was two weeks. <laughs> yeah, two weeks. I think mine was three months. Yeah. But yeah. you've been engaged longer. Yeah. Yeah. So, um, one Sunday, I was going to church thinking that would be a normal day and I met this girl here Bing. at church and she even went to the wrong church. She was supposed to go to another word but Well it to... was the right church because it's the church they told me to go to on the Sunday. Yeah but it's not the right like in it the was, area. Yeah it wasn't close to me. Yeah. It was on the other, completely other side of Rome. So yeah. I was in the south and this church in the, the north. Yeah. East. So. <laughs> she came there and I saw her and she didn't see me. I saw her <laughs> and I thought that she was amazing and she was beautiful. We met at church. We met in the Sunday school class for the YSA. Um, YSA is just like other people of our age between yeah. like 18 to 34. Yeah. Pretty much. Exactly. At, at the church. People who aren't yeah. married. Um, and then you said, Hi, I'm Ricardo. Did I? Yeah. I thought it was Richard. No, you said hi, Ricardo first. Oh. And then I was like, what? Because I didn't understand what you said. Oh. And then he said, hi, I'm Richard. And I was like, oh, strange English name. So I asked her number and uh, I made up like a YSA uh, activity. I said that there would be one, but I didn't back then. Uh, at that time, I didn't arrange it yet. So I said I would text her the date and the time later on. So he sent me a message on the Wednesday to see if I, we wa I wanted to meet up with him in some YSA um, and go out for an ice cream. But I had to check to see if I could because I would work in the evening. And then it turns out that I could because uh, the boys that I looked after were at the cinema with their auntie. So Perfect. Yeah, so I met up with Ricardo. Before that, mm -hmm. I went to church because at that point that day I still didn't have anyone coming because no one answered my messages. So I went to church. <laughs> I went to church because I knew that all of them were going to the English class at church run by the missionaries. So 
I I went there, I was in front of the church, and every time one of the YSA was coming, I would take them and say, no, you're not going, you're coming with me tonight, and you should okay. check your messages. Like a cowboy, if I write them. <laughs> like, <laughs> like a you stay uh, here. Uh. <laughs> so I got them all gathered around me, uh, with me, <laughs> and uh, we went down and met up with Coral, then we got an ice cream, mm -hmm. that was good, wasn't it? It was really good ice cream. <laughs> oh my goodness, it's our favourite place to go now. We haven't been there in ages though. I know. It's amazing. I so I just want to tell you what I had. I can just remember I had Ferrero Rocher, Ferrero Rocher ice cream, but it was like eating full on Ferrero Rochers. Like seriously, how do you say that in Italian? Ferrero Rocher. Ferrero Rocher. Okay. I was eating those because it wasn't even cold. I was just eating crushed up Ferrero Rocher. <laughs> I took you home. And then yeah, he took me home. I wanted to kiss you, but I didn't. Because I thought you wouldn't. I don't know. What? What if I would have kissed you then? Would you have kissed me back? Probably. Uh, but just for the adventure, though. Probably. <laughs> dang it. Which is pretty much the same reason why you kissed me the first time. Probably. Just for adventure. <laughs> uh, anyway, yeah. So what happened? I um, asked you out, right? That was it. Yeah. Then you asked me out for the Saturday, but um. But I don't know, had we arranged that before? No, no. we arranged it that day. I asked you to go out, I yeah. think. Yeah, to go out on Saturday. Okay, but we didn't go out on the Saturday. Well, we did, but we went out on the Friday as well. Yeah, but Friday, couldn't wait. Yeah, Friday wasn't that amazing though, no, really. We just had our first kiss. <laughs> yeah, that was it. <laughs> really? Yeah. We went out on Saturday, yeah. and I took her to one of the best places in Rome. It was a little boat. Rowing. Rowing. <laughs> no bowing. Did you say before? Bowing. <laughs> rowing. Rowing. Rowing boats. Do you call them rowing boats? Yeah, okay. rowing boats. Do so, you know why? No. Because you, you row. row. <laughs> <laughs> wow. So uh, I took her on this rowing boat and I. Oh. I didn't row. Right? Of course you didn't. <laughs> I'm the man. <laughs> anyway, so on that day, on that s exact boat, I asked that her... That very <laughs> same boat. <laughs> the number three. I... No, I don't no, know. Don't know. <laughs> I asked her to be my girlfriend and she accepted. I took up the challenge. Exactly, and move it from an adventure to a serious thing. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you're so funny. <laughs> and so after the bike, we then went and got an ice cream. Again. Always ice cream. Especially because it was summer, so we got ice cream all the yeah, time. It was anyway. so hot. So hot. It was really hot. And then that was that was how we met, and that was how we got together, and finished. Okay, guys. <laughs> <laughs> we hope you can you enjoyed it and if you did enjoy it please share it with your friends and don't forget to subscribe because a lot of you just watch our videos without subscribing this is not good subscribe just down here you know yeah. so guys so guys give us a thumbs up if you like this video yes that would be ding, very ding, nice ding, 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 ding. <laughs> and a foot <laughs> <laughs> anyway yeah bye guys See you next time Ciao on the next now. video. Bye bye. Ciao, ciao, ciao. Ciao, ciao.